Hi class, in this video, I'm going to show you how to use the Vernier Video Analysis app to measure the acceleration of a marble going down a ramp. So to start, I'm going to click Import Video and choose my video that I recorded of me rolling a marble down a ramp. And here is my video. Notice in my video that I have a meter stick clearly visible on screen. The first step to find the acceleration of this marble down the ramp is to slide this slider to the point where I just let go of the marble. So that looks like it is right around here. There is the marble. The next step is I need to define my system in this video. So I will click this system button off to the left, and I will move these circles onto my meter stick, and I will select points on my meter stick that are easy to read. Here I can see that this distance there is 60 centimeters. So up at the top, I will tell the computer that 1,147 pixels is equal to 0 0.6 meters. Next, I need to define my origin. So I will click this origin button off to the left and move these crosshairs to be aiming at my marble and then rotate this X coordinate so that this line is lining up with my ramp. There we go. Next, I need to go up to this add button at the top left and I will start to add the position data of the marble into the software. So all I need to do here is I need to point and click on the marble. And when I click on the marble, it adds a point on the screen and it also auto progresses the video to the next frame. So I just need to keep clicking as the marble goes down the ramp, carefully choosing the same spot on the marble every single time. I am trying to pick the front of the blur as I see this marble rolling. You can see off to the right, there is a data table and a graph being filled with information about the marble's motion. You can see in that graph and just looking at these dots on the screen that this marble is in fact accelerating. The value that we want to get out of this is the actual number telling us the acceleration value of the marble. So here we go, one more point, and there we go. To get the acceleration data, I need to look at these graphs off to the right here. So I'll make that a little bit bigger. And we can see that there's two lines. There's a red line and a blue line. The red line is the X position of the marble, and the blue line is the Y position of the marble. I want to change this by clicking on the Y axis to actually only display the X velocity of the marble. That's what I'm interested in here. So I will open that up and we can see with this graph that the velocity is steadily increasing over time. It's a straight line going up, which is telling us that our marble is speeding up. In other words, accelerating. To get the value of acceleration, I will click and hold to highlight this graph then choose graph tools in the bottom left and choose apply curve fit. I will fit this to a linear function that is MX plus B hit apply. And this will give me all the information I need about this line. So the acceleration of the marble is going to be the slope of this velocity time graph, which is the value M listed here. So the acceleration of my marble down this ramp is 1.511 meters per second per second. In your data table, you will need to collect a bunch of different acceleration values for different angles of your ramp. This is how you complete the project. Good luck. Hopefully you can complete this without too much trouble.